What's up, people? JB the drummer, Charlie Guntier, the guitar extraordinaire over there with his thumbs up or whatever he's doing. Um, today we're going to be getting some deaf, deaf tones, having a listen to Knife Party. I haven't heard Knife Party before. Charles has heard Knife Parties before. He's introducing it to me. Um, Whoa, well, wait, 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 wait. This one, I actually can't remember the, the title, Knife Party. Yeah. I'm thinking I might have heard it, but... Let's see, though. I'll, I'll find out anyway, so. Cool. All right, let's jump in. What is the bassist doing? Sorry, that's the first thing that I noticed. That he's going to is he sliding? Doom doom doom. Cause it sounds it sounds as if he's like detuning the bass as he's going. I don't know if he's detuning it or if he's just doing a slide down, but it's very it's, it's it's standing out to me. It's a nice texture. I love it. There's so many things to talk about, but what is happening with that bass? Well, uh, you know what? So from where I'm hearing it, like Oh, it's a I bit don't know. So, uh, it, it sounded just very it's like it's, it sounded very full on, so I'm not. You, I, I can't distinguish the bass from where right, I'm okay, sounding, okay, where, I'm, I where I'm hearing it. I but you. like, it, it just sounded like, uh, like just it sounded just heavy and, and trashy. I so I'm, I'm hearing the low end, but I'm not hearing like, like fully the bass notes. But okay. all right, play, cool. play, play. Progressions on this year. I, you know, as a musician, something you play a lot of music, you listen to a lot of music, you learn a lot of songs, and you feel like you've heard every chord progression, every inversion, every, you know, articulation of a chord. And I haven't. That chorus was crazy. Mm. The strum impact, the, the, the everything about it, the the layering, the chords that they're using, it sounds crazy. Mm. I, I can't remember, but one 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 subscriber commented and said that um. To, uh, death tones is like, you know, you get death metal. This is like sex metal. It's like it's very. It's got that. It's got that. It does sound very. It sounds like it sounds very cool. It sounds very cool. You know, very cool. Mm, mm, like mm. it. I just can't. Yeah, yeah. This isn't Spider Man Two. This isn't Spider Man Two. This isn't Spider Man Two. This is Tony Hawk PlayStation Two. You know. You're on a level on Tony Hawk's game on PlayStation 2. This is like that for me. It's still dope. I love it. But what are you going to say so far, by the no, way? No, no, no. I, I hear what you're saying about the, the the cool vibe of it. Like kind of their, their, their lifestyle and their culture kind of like bleeds into their kind of music. You know, uh, what they were into at the time. You know, they were... Uh, I think some of them were into skateboarding at the time. And oh, stuff I can. Like wow. That, so know? the so the Tony were... Hawk thing is kind of real then. <laughs> mm? The Tony Hawk uh, comparison. Uh, wow. Well, uh, yeah. 
Yeah. You just said yeah, they were into yeah, skating, yeah. bro. What are you talking about? All right, let me play this thing, bro. You you would you anyway, just said bro, skating, bro. and now you're saying, well, you just said that they were into skating, and I said, yeah. The t all right, let me just. Play. right mm. now Spe speechless wow 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 just like straight off the bat bro it's like how do you like intensity of the song was building without them raging mm. they weren't raging mm. on the instruments they wasn't raging with the chords but that mm. the, the way the vocal was 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 being executed at that point Obviously, with the build-up, there was a slight build-up, but it wasn't anything crazy. But they still had that intensity there, without raging. Mm. Like, mm. I never, I, you know, okay, they kind of came out. Can't remember who came out uh, first before who, but like they kind of came out at the same time as like Corn did. Like, and I and I'd always look at that, like listen to like Deftone stuff, but I'd be like, wow, you know what? They're not riffing, like. Um, like say what Cornwood or like say like um, mm. maybe like what Incubus would in their in their early albums and stuff like that. Progression. I'd be like, well, where's the riff? Where's the yeah. where's the where's the grip? Where's the aggression? Where's the yeah. I want the riffage. But like now, nah, it's like nowadays I'm I'm, I'm appreciating that like more mm. than I did back then. You know, they came they came with it differently. They've yeah. come with it yeah, differently 100%. than the, like the, the standard corn and whatever else. Hundred percent. Whereas corn, in my opinion, have gotten a bit like. like All right, you say every video. You say every corny. bro. You say every video. Well, you, you ish on corn every video, bro. So can we not do I'm that? I'm trying not to, bro. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right. You know what? The, <laughs> can we have one that. video where you that. don't say corn is n loose? Can we just have one video where you just say? <laughs> But yeah, let's finish right. this. Let's finish this. All right, go on, go on.
Bro, did you just cut off the vi- the, the song? Like, wait, it's done. Just let, can't you just let it like just fade away if it's gonna fade uh, away? I let it fade away. All right. That that was all. It cut off early, actually. To be oh, fair, for real, the, the YouTube link, yeah, mate. That that like, man, like. I'm I'm in two minds at the moment. First mind is like, yo, like I've literally been missing out on so much good music over the years. As I always say, like not 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 giving rock a chance, you know, in my adolescence. Like I can only imagine how how much more musically inclined I would have been when you first met me, you know, if I listened to this a bit earlier. Go on. Let JB therapy session begin. Right. You're right. No, it's true though. It's like if 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 I would have let a lot of this music into my repertoire and system at an earlier age, like I wonder how what 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 kind of musician I would be now, what kind of producer I would be now, if I would be better at playing the guitar, you know, for my intro, like because this is this is actually incredible, like to me, like I know people might think, oh, you're exaggerating or you're just doing it for the video, but. As I said before, like I come from a different world completely. Like guitar was, guitar was the sprinkles on the, t- on the top of a cake, whereas mm-hmm. in rock music it is the cake. You know, in gospel music we don't need a guitarist. Like guitarist is like oh, guitarist is like having an oboe player. It's like oh, <laughs> do we need one? Maybe we'll chuck them in somewhere because it's nice. It's like a nice instrument to have. So the, I didn't know that you could. Cr- I didn't know you could be sexy while playing guitars. I didn't know that I thought R and B music it was keys, roads, bling, 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 bling. You know, that's the sexiness. I didn't I did not not ever think that metal rock could be sexy. Like this is suave. This when I hear this I see myself in a nice three piece suit with a nice fedora on, you know. Just looking right. fresh with my beard all nice and done and just like you know, walking into the party, just looking fr- like that's what I see, that's what I feel. You know, it's mm. it's not all you know. Din, din, din. It's we can do it good, but so I like, but I like the the point you made about riffage. There isn't a lot of riffage mm. in this in in this. It's not, yeah, you know what I'm saying. Like, well, I feel like that anybody could actually play it, not in a way that oh, um, as in their skills, but as in if somebody wanted to learn the. Um, progression you know if they want to learn these songs they, they could just play them they, you know what i'm saying that's that's the thing it's the way that they execute minimal riffage minimal um yeah a lot a lot of minimalism but like how they execute it you I, know the aggression dynamics crazy. just it's crazy. yeah stuff I, like that i i i i i I have always wondered, man, do you know what? This is going to sound really crazy, by the way. This is going to sound very, very crazy. But please, you know, just try and understand what I'm trying to say. And I'm not trying to go against anything. But because, yes, R&B and hip hop and stuff like that, it's great. It's great fun. It's great fun. You know, listening to okay. the songs. All right. It's for me personally. This is my own opinion. I always wonder where you're gonna go. Okay, you don't I, know. Let I me swear. I, honestly, allow bro. me the latitude anyway, of completion. Allow me the grat- <laughs> the latitude of completion. Um, listen. Oh my God. It it it, it hip hop and that is fun. It's amazing. You know, the low eight oh eight doom do doom. But in the in the in the present time we're in right now. There for me, there's been a disconnect from R and B and like you know drill and hip hop and trap. There's been a massive dis- disconnect. I just don't connect with the musicality and the the chords and even the stories they're telling. I just there's been a like I don't get it anymore. And okay. I've been very like I know this is my therapy session, but I've been disconnected from that whole genre for a while so i've kind of been a nomad musically a a musical nomad because i'm a musician and i need to stay up to date with music but i'm not interested in you know what i've been listening to and hearing the bands that you've introduced me to it feels like a it feels like a musical refreshing rejuvenation because i'm like i feel like i feel it i feel the energy of the songs of the music i know why you was a grunger when you were a teenager i can i'm i can feel it 
I can feel why you you liked these bands. Like I can understand now the musicality, the chords, the atmosphere it sets for you. You know, it's 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 really an amazing it's a, it's an amazing thing. You know, um, I I can't wait until I find something that's trash because I I'm gonna say it's. I know it feels like every video I'm just saying everything's amazing and all right, this is, all right, this is all right. Good, I, I, Let's 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 uh let's pinpoint something you don't like about this song. There's nothing what I don't like about like? it. There's nothing. That nothing. I I, okay, Absolutely there's one thing. There's, nothing. A, there's one thing. It, it ended too soon. That was it. I, uh? it, it ended too soon. There wasn't enough. That that was it. Wow. Okay. We'll, we'll... All right. All right. That the the drumming on this though, like the tone. No. Okay. See now, I I bet you. You have a you're not into the tone. The tone is fine. I I, I don't agree with you saying the drumming. The drumming wasn't. No, it didn't stand like, out. It I didn't like, stand out uh, more than anything else. That's one thing I'll say about the um, about Deftones is that the drummer, like like he sounds like he's always kind of like doing the most. Mm -hmm. Like you know what I'm saying. He has the most. What I I'll probably say he has the most energy. Mm -hmm. the, the chords, what is being played, whatever yeah. else yeah. you know, the bass, whatever. They've got they they bring the energy as well, right? But um, without without the dynamics of the drums, yeah, like yeah, I hear like, you. I hear just you. get lost. He wasn't doing anything crazy. He wasn't doing anything crazy. No, he wasn't he was, doing he was anything playing. crazy. I think, but he, it was it was it was to me it was like um, dynamic enough. Like he could have played that straight. He was. He gave it the energy that's needed. That's right. needed. Right. I hate. I hate. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. Of course. Of course. Yeah. I hear you. I think because you've listened to other songs of theirs, you probably mm -hmm. are taking in that bias into this. Because I didn't hear anything, you know, sticky outy. It was just like, okay, yeah, he's doing what the song requires. But everyone was doing what the song required. The guitar. Everyone was doing what the song required. If, if anything, the bass man was doing some interesting things with those slides in a song i found that very appealing but but yeah without without making this video twenty five thousand years long um, i'm gonna wrap it up here but again if anyone is watching past this point first thing first i want to say thank you because we're just two boys from london chatting about music rock music so thank you for watching um and also if you want to support us um We've got a Patreon. We're too embarrassed to, you know, promote it at the beginning because, you know, we're not there yet. But it's about it's only three three pounds, so it's like a sandwich, you know, if you wanna, you know, support us. But yeah, uh thank you guys for watching and hopefully we'll see you in the next one. So peace. Peace.